Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. It is the 29th of March and today we are killing three off-world security officers while harming as few people as possible. We are weak, have a supplier, tough, ex-sovereign. Uh, half of those, all of those don't, well, three of those don't matter. Uh, we've got a quick fire armor piercing shotgun, which is kind of nice. A swapper, which is excellent. Slipstream, fantastic. Let's go. All right, we got shotguns everywhere. Everyone on the ship has a shotgun, including me. Light reinforcements, autopilot, probably swapping in and then slipstreaming out. Now let's see what the ship looks like. Yeah, where are you, target? There. All right, so we could swap from the outside. It is very difficult to tell whether they're standing in the middle of the room, though. The colors, uh, they're probably on the outside. Yeah, that's not standing in the middle. Uh, they're not standing in the middle and they're not holding the keys, so should be pretty safe to just swap in. Trying not to harm people, that should be fine enough. I'm gonna unequip the shotgun just so that I don't accidentally use it and I accidentally scrolled out. All right, there we go. Yeah, this is a little iffy with that window, but we're fine. All right. And then, yeah, we have to use a slipstream because otherwise they're going to be shooting. Uh, we could run up here for a crate or run over here for a crate. This one's a little easier to get to. Or it's a little faster to get to. All right, remote control. Just ignore everyone. They're not going to be able to shoot at me anyways. Please don't drift too far. Extra swapper. Interesting. Please. Oh, come on. <laughs> I lost slipstream. <laughs> Right here. Please catch. Yes. Okay. 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 And then we're off. For eight seconds. Very nice. Uh, I should have been a little more careful there to make sure the ship unloaded. I don't think there's actually enough time, but there's potentially enough time for someone to walk out and get tossed into space. Oh, supplier. Nice. So I don't need to worry about bullets. Granted, I have 12 bullets and it's a kill two more people, so I don't think I need to worry too much about that. Hey, our target has glitch dash, heat sensor, concussive gun. We can potentially get them to teleport to us. Uh, double check. Yeah. Should have checked how far it was, but we're fine. Target. Is invisible to my eye. There they are. Okay, that's... Probably a swap in as well. Uh, I didn't check if they had the key or not. They don't have the key. All right, we're good. Mm 
Okay, so we gotta be a little careful here. Ship's gonna bonk. Nothing I can do about that. Alright, so we're gonna... Steal key card, deactivate gun. Got a crate over there that we don't want. Need to make sure that we don't shoot where people teleport in. Alright, so we leave the sight of both of them. Make sure no one else can hear. And then we shoot to make them stop walking. Open crate for just more sw more swaps. Today's a swappy day, I suppose. And then we run out. And do it properly this time. All right, so shoot to get ourselves to move this way so we can more easily match speed. Is that a super shotgun? It is a super shotgun. I wonder if 12 bullets... Let's see, ship's unloaded, yeah. I wonder if twelve the 12 bullets with the super shotgun and slipstream speeding us up. I wonder if that is enough to get us away from... to break free from the ship's effect rate at a decent speed. I'm not sure. 12 bullets doesn't sound like a lot. If we had a second shotgun, I would definitely be down to try it out. All right, drop them off, and for our last one, we've got shields everywhere. We can potentially lure the target to a window with their glitch dashing. Heavy reinforcements, lots of guards, that's all fine. Okay, got everything in stash, and we're just going to be teleporting in. Assuming there's a locked door. Okay, never mind. There's a locked door, but it's useless. All right, so go here. We got some pretty good swaps. We can probably bypass a lot of hallways down here. Uh, targets right here. That's close enough to get them to a window, and that's all I care about. Dit, 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 dit. All right. So yeah. So like this is a this seems this is like an okay swap. Uh, so normally we'd have to go down here for the key. All right. So potential option we have: run down here, shoot. Uh, we then have, I think. Uh, I'm not sure. They might be too far. We'll have at least one glitch dasher. Okay, we'll have at least two glitch dashers going down here. There's a pretty good chance of one of them opening the door. And then we get this key. And then we can skip this hallway with a swap or a swap with up here. Either way, works pretty good. And then we just run up here. Don't even need this key. Run up here shoot to get you to go down here and then we're good yeah that seems pretty good how large is this we can also just do a swap 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 steal swap and no saving time on this bit it seems like the best spot all right slip stream run and then we're just minimizing harm but everyone's got shields so i feel pretty decent about that i'm a little concerned about uh shooting myself with a reflection actually can i just swap in i can almost swap in all right they open the door for me if they did teleport in front in a way that would reflect, 
then I would probably use the extreme range swapper to just get out of the way. Uh, but we're good. Um, when do I need swappers? So swap. Oh, I just swap, swap. Actually. It doesn't save much time. But might as well use the swap when I've got no other use for it. And then I need to get the pod moving soon. We go swap, steal. This is a little scary, but I'll just deal with it. Or not. Uh, I need to move to this one. Okay. Make sure I have momentum. Swap. Steal. Watch out for that reflection. Okay, no reflection. We're good. I accidentally swapped with the glitch dasher, which is exactly what I wanted to do. Go me, go me. Alright, so then I run up here. Use this remaining time to get the pod in a decent spot. Alright, and then I just get off to a corner to get you to join me. And then break the window with my body. And make sure we both fall out. Alright. And then make sure it's unloaded. And then we're all good. Perfect. Alright. Perfectly used all three of our swaps. That was very nice. Used three slipstreams, one for ship. Very nice. Yeah, that was good. I was wondering how helpful the extra swappers would be, and they did, I guess. The extreme range swapper was the most helpful one there. Uh, for ship three, at least. And then the other two were just nice to haves. That just saved a little bit of time. Uh, but we toss them in with 599, and that leaves us in first place with a fair bit of a lead. Uh, yeah. Today was going to be fast, no matter what, with Slipstream and a Swapper to begin with. Um, but yeah, I had pretty good docks and swaps and above average pickups today. And then there could have been differences between us picking up different crates, getting different items. So curious if that's what caused. Can't remember where did I get the extreme range one? I think that was on ship two. Yeah, that was ship two. Glad I went for that crate. That was very nice. All right. And that's it for today. Yesterday, I screwed up. I dashed into a... <laughs> I dashed into a sentry gun. Thinking that I was protected. But I was also dashing through a crash door. Whoops. Uh, turns out I had a different item than 7-2 did. From the crate. At least I think it was from the same crate. I haven't watched this video yet. Uh, but... They got a swapper instead of a, whatchamacallit, emergency shield, which was a lot more helpful. And that, uh, that shield also gave me a, a bit of undue confidence. So, uh, in <laughs> going through that. So that's a little bit unfortunate, but it happens. Uh, but very nice job, regardless. 7-2, taking the top spot with 39 seconds. We have DD Shock Trooper in second. Cassandra in third. Debt Imaginer in fourth. And Zazaza in fifth place, making up the top five. Good job, everybody. And with that, that is all for today's daily challenge. This is a new one. This is a new one. Uh, this is tomorrow's. Oh, it's tomorrow's a challenge Saturday. A shaky week challenge Saturday. 
I was just not killing people. That should be fine. Um, but that's all for today. Thank you for watching. And I actually, actually mm, I want to test something. I want to test something. So we're uh, going back in time just a little bit. Change galaxy. Can I just reload this galaxy? All right. I want, I want to test how long it takes to leave with 12 bullets and a slipstream. That's all I want to do. This is, it's only 12 bullets, but it is a super shotgun. Super shotgun is either the most powerful or tied for the most powerful. As far as knockback goes on yourself. All right, turn to pod, pop out. All right, so we're at beginning of four seconds now. I'll we'll do the slipstream. And we go boop, 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 boop. Uh, but the tracker's gun is also very strong. I'm not sure which one's stronger. I want to say the tracker's gun is at the very least tied for the most strongest. All right, so that's all the shots that we get. It's not a whole lot of shots, but we've made some pretty good distance so far. So let's see how much time it takes. Five. Oh, this is not promising. Uh, that's a pretty good distance. Five. Wait. Okay, there we go. Six. Start at four. If we can get under seven, then it's definitely a huge success. Seven. Eight. Okay, it's lower than pod. Nine. Okay, not enough bullets. All right, in this case, I can just uh, undo doing slow. All right, so it takes five seconds. All right, so we started out at four. So it takes over five seconds because we started at the very beginning of four seconds. Not sure how much longer because there's no decimal. That's something I want to try and mod in. I can never break the game's code. I want to mod in a decimal <laughs> for milliseconds or what have you, or even tenths of seconds would be handy. Okay, so a uh, supplier with a super shotgun is by itself is not enough to adequately uh, shoot yourself away. If you have like the proper shotgun bullets amount and you can do it a whole lot with the slipstream uh we've gone down to two seconds of leaving which is faster than the three and change of the pod all right good little science all right where do i i never know where to sit <laughs> i don't know where to sit I'm a special character. I don't sit down at the bar like normal. All right, well, uh, we'll just sit in this chair. This looks, this looks like, oh, there it is. Yay. All right, well, that is all for today's daily challenge and a little experiment. Good info we got there. Um, yeah, 
That's all for today. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you tomorrow.